up y'all how y'all doing today it's your crochet and i'm back with another freaking house tour y'all now today i'm about to be looking through a house that is in georgia i believe so let's go ahead and get this house started y'all so it's already give it look, i like it from the outside it does look gorgeous okay it is six hundred fifty thousand dollars five bedroom three bath two thousand eight hundred square feet on a 0 0.26 acre lot y'all I think that price is absolutely good. It does have an HOA fee though, and it's $126 a month. Y'all know HOA fees usually just cover like little things, sometimes grass and stuff like that, but it's just up to you if you feel like you could do an HOA fee. Sometimes I feel like I cannot, I don't want to. Like why should I have to deal? Why should I have to pay somebody on top of paying my mortgage? I cut it myself. But now I'm looking at my house in the front. Y'all don't wanna see the front of my house. Maybe I should have made an HOA. Okay, because uh, when things get crazy, things get crazy. I actually lost my saw. That's why I lost my saw and I stopped working on the front. And now I'm telling you, it's like it's a jungle out there. Anyways, that was the front door. Now we're looking into the dining. It's absolutely gorgeous, but I don't like how there's carpet in the dining. Y'all know I spoke about the reason why I don't use my dining room right here because it has carpet. So to come into a house. Um, with a better cleaner carpet and stuff like that. I will not I will not put that down I would have to pull that carpet up before I could put that table down on the ground Um, I absolutely love the the ceilings the ceiling is absolutely gorgeous and it's giving like that little crown is that called crown molding I'm, I think I'm learning some stuff y'all. I think I'm learning some stuff for real um, going down this way, this looks like it's to maybe the kitchen or living room, but it does give me this nice, nice little area right there where I feel like I would make that into like my little coffee spot or stuff like that. I don't know what I would do. I don't, but I definitely do want a little coffee area. I know that. I know that. So over here, there goes the stairs, immediately the stairs. Um, it does not look to where I can definitely decorate for Christmas. Yeah, I know I'm big on that. I really want to be able to like do my stairs and stuff like just decorate completely. I do love the high ceilings in this area. I love the fireplace, but it also does seem like it's kind of like boxed in, you know what I'm saying? I'm be we've been looking at some houses where the living room area is completely like open y'all. So just to see like a living room area kind of like boxed in a little bit it makes it feel like it's smaller it does i do like the way that they have these curtains that go all the way up i've never seen that it's like you could put it there but they have it go all the way up i actually like that they're gonna want to try that in my house <laughs> that's cute to have the curtains that go all the way up in the back i've never imagined to do nothing like that i always just put it right on the rod and call it a day y'all um this right here is supposed to be a bedroom Please don't be the master. I know that one. Um, it's a nice size. I'm not saying please don't be the master. It's just because it's connected to the, the outside. And I really want my master to be my master. It doesn't look like it has a big closet either. I want my master to stay like my master. Don't come in here type situation. I want my space to be my space. I'm so used to just giving. I'm telling you, even yesterday, there was, can I take a shower in your room? Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> like, yo, let your space be your space. Can I please, can I get a little bit of something? Can I get a little bit of something? Can I get a little piece of something? So going over here, this looks like, this is what the, I seen earlier that I said I might turn into a coffee bar. Maybe I could have like a little wine slash alcohol um, cabinets. You know what I'm saying? So I do like the fireplace in here. I like how it came over from the other side. That's absolutely gorgeous. I do like that. Um, it gives you another little sitting area. So it does, even though you know how you, it, you walk into a sitting area, so it's like one sitting area here, one sitting area over there. There's three. I would make this an office, put a door up, let that slide back and forth because, oh, you know what? I wonder if there's three downstairs because they don't have one upstairs. Because y'all know I really want, I want at least three living spaces. But I really want one to be upstairs, like in the loft area for the kids. So if there's one upstairs, 100%, I would make that first living room when you first walk in the house, uh, office. But if there is, isn't one, 
I I would hate to make one of the, those rooms for the kids because when I say the kids are gonna tear it up, they're gonna tear it up and let it be dirty daily. But this is a nice size living room, nice kitchen. I love how it has a ceiling fan. I love how you can walk out. Well, I look like you can walk outside. Guess not. I don't know how big it is back there at all. Um. Okay, look like you can walk that way too and you can't, they keep tricking me. They keep tricking me. But I think I've seen everything downstairs already. So now is it time to go upstairs? Is it that time? Is it that time? Here we go. Okay. So it does not look like I get a loft area up here, which I kind of figured. Um, so that, that's why they gave you all the living room spaces downstairs. I just don't want them. I'm telling you, when I, I want them, I want them to have a loft 100%, but I need it to be away. Cause that's the reason why I feel like I gotta clean so much because we have people come in and out the house. This is a nice size room for anybody actually. They had it set up as a nursery, but it's a really nice size room. Up in here, nice bathroom that's connected to a bedroom. Two sinks, I love that. Cause a lot of the time you don't see two sinks unless it's a master. So to see two sinks in houses nowadays, I, I love it. I love it. It's giving multiple kids, you know, that, cause they, they gonna fight. They gonna fight. Like I was in here for, I was using the sink. Like any, any type of thing you can use as an argument. Y'all, I'm trying to, I'm trying to feel like I could break them arguments down to, I know they're going to argue regardless, but can I break it down to instead of 50 times a day, can they break it down to about 10? Can I break it down to about 10? Okay, it has a ceiling fan, a nice big window. I thought you was able to walk out to the back, not out to the back, but I thought it had like a little deck or something out there, or a little patio. It doesn't, but it does give you space in here because that looks like a big bed. And for you just to have space to put dressers and stuff like that, it's a big room. And then this is the bathroom that you're able to access from that room. Now, let's keep going. Uh oh, let's keep going. Now going down this hall, you can see down to the, the front door. And then here goes a room right here. I like this room. For sure, we would have to make it into a bedroom. It couldn't be an office. But it does not have a ceiling fan. This is kind of like my son's room. My son does not have, every room has a ceiling fan but his. Um, but the way that they decorated it, you can see there's a bunch of space. Like you could have your your couch and a bunch of books and stuff like that. But I would definitely put a bed for my son and put a, um, a ceiling fan. This right here is the washer dryer area. It does not look too big, but the way that they kind of decked it off or kind of figured out the spaces and the way it could go, <laughs> it make it look big. And it's bigger than what I got because y'all know our washer and dryer is out to the world. It's out to the world, y'all. It's not there. So now we're going into the master, and I hope this master is changing. It's changing lives, okay? I hope it's changing lives. Now, it's a nice master. It does not have a ceiling fan as well. Like, what? The master don't have a ceiling fan? Oh, baby, that would have to change. That would have to change. I would definitely plug in, like, a fireplace right there, 100%. What the heck? It won't let me show the master bathroom? Okay, this is where the master bathroom is. When I try to click over here, it kicks me out. Okay, we're gonna try again, let me see. It kicks me out, it kicks me out. I cannot go into the master bathroom. I gotta see this master bathroom though, cause I would never, I would never get a house and I'd not see the master bathroom. I could just never. I could never, ever, 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 ever. I would have to go through the pictures and try to figure it out. Yeah, let's, we gonna do this. We gonna, we gonna have to find this master. You got to find that master bathroom. Okay. Oh, there's a million pictures. You know, I have to try to go through and make this as fast as possible. Because it's about that time. It's about that time. Um, uh oh. The house is giving gorgeous. So I love, I absolutely love the flooring. I love the kitchen. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I, lo I love it. It's giving nice. The bedrooms is giving nice. The carpets are a little, are, uh, they are a little <sighs> light. They're really light. Here goes the bathroom. 
it's not showing how big the shower is but it's giving the same size of the shower i got now um it does have a tub it does give you his and her sink with the you know like the little makeup vanity part so that's absolutely gorgeous i need that i just feel like the shower might be too too small and then now we gotta look at this backyard because they wouldn't give me you no know, access to the backyard the house is gorgeous though i like it especially 650 that's not bad that is not bad that is not bad okay so it does give you a decent sized backyard it's not small but it's not big enough for me to have my animals either but 100 percent, you could definitely come out here and make the beautiful big big beautiful pool area that you would need you could still have a little running space on the side it gives you a lot of room back there it's just not personally it's just I feel like certain areas just wasn't given on certain areas. I love the back though. The back is given. I'm telling you, the back is nice. Um, I don't know what's making me. I think I mean, I think because they don't have the ceiling fans, but I feel like that's an easy fix. I feel like it had to have something that really drew me in, and I feel like it's missing. It's still missing. Um, just an extra bedroom. And usually, even though I look at five bedrooms, um. I'd be looking for space. Like, oh, I could definitely put a room right there. I could definitely put a room right there. I could definitely 100%. Everything seemed tight. And then I don't want the kids loft area to be downstairs. When I tell you if that is, that's just going to mess it up. I already know it. Because they took over, when I said they took over my living room, and y'all see how they did my couches. Y'all see how they just, y'all, I can't. No. <laughs> no. I feel like, No. No. I can't, I can't, I can't. Um, for me, what I would give it, I would give it a seven because it's still really cute. I really like it. Um, it's just for for me and my family, there's certain things I just cannot do. And I cannot have the kids loft area, living room area downstairs. Never again. Cause I feel like every day, every day I'm picking something up every day. You no, know, no matter how many conversations his dad, their, their dad has had with them and I've had with them, it, it has not changed and it will not. I don't, I, mean, I don't see it changing. I don't. Um, yeah, I just give it a seven mainly because of that. The master, I didn't even know. I don't, I didn't see the closet. Did I see the master closet. I don't even think I see the master closet. I don't know too much about the master for me to not know about where I'm going to say my room. Oh, I need to know. I didn't know something. That should have been the only room you mainly showed all the information of. But I didn't get that. So I feel like, no, like I, I can't. I can't. But I liked it. I loved it. I'll view it again. I'll view it again. Catch you in the next one. See you later. Bye.